What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. So for those of you that don't know me, I'm Maya and today we're going to be doing a Zara and ASOS spring summer haul. Yeah, I spent over 300 euro, I think it was, just because I needed a whole new wardrobe revamp. Um, all I had was like plain little tees and like plain crop tops and just denim jeans and I just need a bit more color in my wardrobe. So we'll just get straight into the video. Okay guys, so first up is this little cropped pink shirt. Um, I kind of wish I went up a size because it's a bit short. I have quite long arms and it's a bit short on my arms. And these jeans, I know I would have loved these jeans, but I should have went up a size. I'm usually a size eight, I got size eight and uh, they're tiny and they give me a big camel toe. This is kind of the only way I can show you guys. But yeah, as you can zip them up. I think they're so cute. This is my favorite color, denim, but so cute. Okay, next I have this little crop top cami thing. Um, I love the color for summer, it's so cute. I think it'd be so nice with blue denim, with white denim, and you can just like mix and match these. And even with like a little shirt over, like open. I think it's adorable. Okay, so since I loved it so much, I got it in blue as well. Um, I feel like it goes with blue denim as well, but I probably match it with white denim or like orange. I feel like if you had something orange, it'd be really cute. Love it. Are you gonna be in it? Okay. Okay guys, so next we have, I think they're the same pair of jeans. I'm not sure if they're the exact same style or if they're a little bit different. I'll link everything in the description box below anyway. Um, so once again, it's a pair of flared jeans. Um, I got these in white and I actually got them in a size 10. And I'm not sure if I should have got a size eight or not in these and I don't know. Maybe if I just take them in. But I kind of like how loose they're fitting. Anyway, they're very comfortable. They're very long. Like I'm wearing my Ugg slippers <laughs> underneath because they keep touching the floor. But I think they're so flattering. Like, I have no bum, but I feel like these don't squash, you know, squash the bum and like give me a complete pancake gas. And then I got this little lemon shirt. Um, I just thought it'd be really cute for the summer, even with white or with the bleach denim I already showed. I think it's gorgeous. And with a little tan, even with, I thought with like um, a bright, or even a nude pair of cycling shorts and a pair of heels or something in a bag. That'd be gorgeous. Okay, so next we have this little nude racer top. You literally can't go wrong. I have these on black and white from last summer, I think it was. And I wear them up like into the winter and stuff with joggers. Um, yeah, that's the back. I feel like nude is so nice in the summer as well. Can't go wrong. Denim, you can wear it with literally anything like I don't even need to tell you <laughs> but yeah it's very comfortable and I'm pretty sure they're they're really cheap as well I think they're only like five euro four euro so handy little thing to have so since I got the nude obviously I had to get the lemon one I tend to always buy like with little staple pieces like this I tend to buy loads of different colors just because like they literally save you like this is an outfit and throw on a little bag and like a black heel or something and like you're good to go. Do you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, lemon be cute for the summer with a tan, without a tan, doesn't really matter. <laughs> um, cheap as well, so can't go wrong. And then next is another little staple piece. It's this nude bodysuit. Sarah do loads of these. But I thought this one would be just like the straps here are just a little bit dressier than the other ones that everyone has, do you know that kind of way? I thought with like a little skirt in the summer, it'd be gorgeous. You could even wear it with jeans or whatever. It's very, 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 very comfortable as well. And you can rock the no bra. Oh, next we have these little shorts, I was gonna say booty shorts, <laughs> high-waisted shorts. So I got these, now hear me out on these. I know you're like, why the hell did she get them? Um, I was thinking they'd be really cute with like a really short crop top and a blazer and a pair of trainers and some long socks or something. I don't have a blazer to show you. I'm still hunting for a good blazer, but I just thought, you know, they're real high-waisted and like they don't 
show the bum like your ass doesn't come out or anything so wearing a blazer with it wouldn't be too bad at all they're a bit see-through but i think if you wear it the right like knickers and stuff they are gorgeous and next we have this oversized shirt it's actually very long i didn't think it would be this long um i won't necessarily pair it with this but i didn't know what else to show you with and it's actually an oversized one like i didn't go up a size this is a small so definitely get your size in this if you are going to i think it'd be really cute i think it's you just can't go wrong with an oversized shirt can you like you know what i mean you can throw it on with shorts i think with denim shorts and a little cropped up be nice and like some long socks and trainers, or you could even do like, you know, a pair of heels, something like that. Yeah, just a little staple piece as well. Okay, so here we are on this one. I don't, I don't know to be honest where I was going with this, but these shorts, staple piece as well. They don't show the bum. They're from the um seamless collection and they're so soft they're literally the comfiest things ever and they don't give you a camel toe either i was thinking as well they'd be really cute with an oversized white t-shirt and like some air force or something long socks the shirt i'm not sure i don't know like i don't know where i was going with this like i see these linen shirts on loads of people and they look so cute but i don't know maybe i'm not wearing it right Okay, so that's it for the Zara bits. Now I'm just gonna move on to the few bits I got from ASOS. Um, I got this little dress. Didn't think it'd be this open, first of all. I think I might get it stitched a little bit, like just there. Just cause if you've no cleavage, I feel like it looks a bit bare, you know? It's real girly, but I think you could also wear it with like black boots or like docks or something like that and a leather jacket. You could even wear it with tights when it gets colder or you could dress it up with a pair of heels little denim jacket even and then i got these heels that you cannot see <laughs> got these heels from asos but they were semi i think it's called they're very tall as well i'm not i'll give you a close-up on them um but i'm a bit unsure on them as well and the dress as well got a small but i think i could have probably went for an extra small like look at this but cute right, so next is this little smock dress i think it's called from collusion i think that might be one of asos's own brands i'm not sure but anyways i <laughs> did not think it come like this like this puff sleeves make me look like wednesday adams or something i don't know it's a bit halloweenish i think the puff sleeves annoy me but apart from that i think it's really cute and you could wear it with trainers, you could wear it with like little black boots, you could wear it with sandals as well, you know, like flat sandals. It's cute, it's cute. It's also very comfortable, but I'm just, it's the puff sleeve for me. I just, I don't know, like, look. Right, straight away, it looks better. Yeah, I think that's it for the haul, pretty much. Yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Actually, no. One more thing. <laughs> I got the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation. I feel like every time NARS, uh, not NARS, sorry, ASOS has their 20% off. I always just stock up on makeup because 20% off, who doesn't love that? And makeup's expensive. Um, so yeah, I just got that in Shade Barcelona. You probably know about this, but this is my all time favorite foundation. So I think that's it for our little haul. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that haul. Um, as I said, I'm not 100% sure on everything, so I actually might end up returning some bits like this big puffy sleeve dress. <laughs> but um, most of the bits I'll probably keep or just change sizes and stuff like that. Um, I ordered everything in a size eight and the only thing I'd recommend going up a size in is the jeans as i said i'll link everything below Um, i'll be going up a size as well so if you're gonna get them definitely go up a size because i'm usually an eight and i need a ten Um, so yeah that concludes our little haul and um, i hope you enjoyed the video if you did please 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 like 
and press that subscribe button because it helps the channel out so much and it helps me grow. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.